Hey everyone, so welcome to this video and in this video we'll try to solve one more problem on binary tree, right? So the problem statement is we just need to find out the sum of all these nodes in the given tree, right? So it is around 82, okay? So uh, here we have two possibilities. The first is if node is null, okay? If node is null and the second is if node is not null, right? So let's discuss these two conditions. So the condition one is if node is null. So in that case, we will simply return zero. And the second condition is if node is not null. So in that case, we'll return node of data because we want the sum of all these nodes, right? Plus this is the recursive function will pass the left child of the node plus recursive function and here will pass the right child okay so this is the pseudocode for how to calculate the sum of all these nodes in this tree right so now let's execute this code on this tree so this is uh, a function which is calculating the sum of these nodes so here we'll pass root node as a parameter so the first condition is if node is null so here in this case node is not null so it will execute the second condition so it will go to its left child okay so left child which is 6 so 6 is not null so it will visit its left child so 4 is also not null so it will visit its left child now fourth left child is null okay so it will return 0 from here now after visiting the left child it will visit its right child okay so right child is also null so from here also it will get 0 so this value is 0 and this value is also 0 for node number 4 now it will return node of data plus this plus this okay so node of data is 4 so it will return 4 to its parent node okay now for node number 6 left hand side is completed now it will visit the right hand side so right hand side now for it its left hand side is 0 okay and right child is also null so from here it will get 0 so for 8 also this value is 0 and this value is also 0 so total value is 8 plus 0 plus 0 okay which is 8 so it will simply return 8 now for node number 6 from left hand side we are getting 4 and from right hand side we are getting 8 right and node of data is 6 it means 6 plus 4 plus 8 which is 18 right so it will return 18 to its parent node now for left hand side uh, of node number 10 the output is 18 okay now it will execute its right hand side so currently we are here on node number 18 now we'll visit its left child so we are at 15 we'll visit its left child which is null so it will return 0 from here then right child which is again null so from here we'll get 0 and it will return 15 to its parent okay so because we are returning root of data plus left hand child plus right hand child okay so it will return 15 to its parent node now it will visit its right hand child for 21 also the left is 0 sorry null so it will return 0 and right child is also null so from here it will get 0 so it will return 21 to its parent node so from left hand side we are getting 15 and from right hand side we are getting 21 so 15 plus 21 so 15 is this value 
and 21 is this value right and node of data is 18 so plus 18 so it is 36 36 plus 18 which is uh, 54 okay so it will return 54 to its parent node right so from left hand side we are getting 18 and from right hand side we are getting 54 so the total value is 54 plus 18 plus 10 because 10 is node of data so 54 plus 18 54 plus 10 is 64 and 64 plus 18 which is 82 okay so this will be the output now let's write the code so here i have created this same tree okay now here i'll create a function which is node sum okay and i'll pass root node as a parameter so the first condition is if root is null so we'll return 0 and the second condition is if root is not null so we'll return 1 plus node sum here we'll pass root of left okay plus node sum and root of right so this is the second condition okay now we just need to call this function here so and this is how you can find out the sum of all these nodes in the tree okay so let's build this think let me save this first oh sorry it is the uh, root of data So here the sum is 82 okay so this is how we can find the sum of all these nodes in a tree right so that's it for this video thank you